Today I'm going to show you an overview of the SchoolNet Reporting Dashboard. On your home screen, you will notice several distinct sections, including My Classroom, Classroom Assessment Monitor, Classroom Profile, SchoolNet Resources, Current and Upcoming Assessments, and WCPS District Resources. Please refer to WCPS District Resources for customized modules for Washington County. Let's begin by locating the section titled Classroom Assessment Monitor. In this section, you can view assessment data by first finding the District and Local Test tab. Select an assessment from the drop-down menu. For any assessment, you can view different types of reports, such as a test summary, standards analysis, and item analysis. You can also view data by overall performance and performance by standard. To locate the reporting dashboard, scroll up to the top of the screen, locate the My Classroom section, and click on Reports. You can filter your results by all categories or looking at subject, grade, or dates. You can also select Clear All Filters. To select the assessment that you would like to find reports on, you can do it one of several ways. You can click on the checkbox next to the name of the test, find the drop down menu on the right hand side, and select the test that you're interested in looking at or you can simply double click the name of the test. The next screen you land on is the test report, specifically the test summary tab. You can also click on the other available tabs to view by standards analysis, item analysis, standards mastery, or trends. On the Test Summary tab, you will see a summary of how your students did as a group, as well as by individual students. You can also view by subgroup or by standard. The Standards Analysis Report shows you how your students did by standards. Notice the Primary Alignments button in the upper right hand corner. By unchecking this box, you will see specific standards that were assessed. You can also view by student or by subgroup. In the Item Analysis tab, you will see how your students did by question. By clicking on the item number, you will be able to view the actual question. Click back to item analysis to receive the report. Below each of the items, you will find the standards that were tested for that particular question. On the Standards Mastery tab, you will see how your students did on each standard. The Trends tab allows you to compare assessment data from multiple assessments, if available. More detailed information regarding reporting and data collection will be discussed in Module 3.